Hi, I'm Dina Tobin from Dina Tobin and Associates. We're back today on the artist story, again with Diana Risco Lind, a multimedia artist based in Lima, Peru. She's gonna tell us a little bit more about uh, what brought her to become an artist. Yeah, um, thank you, Dina. Um, something that uh, that uh, I really thought um, uh, was interesting in school is, was that I was a student that liked all subjects, mm -hmm. um, and even though some subjects, like I wasn't, I wasn't good at everything, but um, but I thought everything was interesting, mm -hmm. um, and I think that also. Um, made me think of art as a as a as a profession because i feel that art is like um you can use art to talk about any subject um, and very i think not every profession um you can actually do that right um so i was i always see art as uh, a way to investigate different subjects a way to be sensible to different subjects and um, and give you your opinion about uh, different ideas and actually you can actually go into different subjects in a different way. So um, since I had this um, global love for several things, I felt that through art you can actually canalize any of these um, um, any of these topics through through um, fine arts, through different um, materials. That's why also I also I also like um, the idea of working with different materials because different materials talk um, in a different way. Also, you can use it as uh, means to communicate as well. Mm -hmm. It really gives you like a, a avenue to communicate different topics or feelings or ideas through different media. Yes, I think um, different media. Uh, add to the conversation like you can have an image that um, talks about something um, that looks like something but if you also give it a a certain material the material is also adding to the information that you're giving 